Hello everyone. This is our final episode in our Ruby Princess series. If we only have two episodes, can we call it a series? Sure, why not? This video subject is about the most sought after cruise information by would-be cruisers all around the world. The food. Jen and I read quite a bit of negativity about the Ruby's food quality. However, we were pleasantly surprised and had no issues with the free options available to us. Slice Pizza, Jen really liked it. I found it to be on par with most other cruise ships. Our cruise missed two of three stops due to high winds and surf. Because of that, we all got an onboard credit. We decided to eat at the Crown Grill restaurant. Jen and I got the steak and lobster. It was great, but exactly of the same quality as we got on lobster night in the main dining room. I'm a big fan of the buffet. I read a comment where a gentleman compared it to Golden Corral. He put that as a negative, but for me, I enjoy the buffet and typically prefer it. I especially like the buffet for breakfast and seconds of ease and brunch. And my favorite meal of the cruise was actually seafood day on the buffet, where the fish and the grilled shrimp were outstanding.
Our main dining room was the Da Vinci Room. The staff and the food were great. Our party ate there every night and found it of high quality. All in all, we thoroughly enjoyed the food offerings on Ruby. I put the pasta, pasta chef. What? Should I do the pasta inside? The water. Be careful, huh? Okay. Remember last time you blown the water, huh? I'm Italian. Stay. This is the reason why I tell you. Okay. Um, Check your tomato. Yeah, good. Go with, with the pasta. pasta. Okay, go. I ahead. know how to cook pasta. This is from family to family. Hallelujah. Easy, chef. I know you're leaving, but easy, chef. So get the pasta today or this was. <laughs> yeah, can we ensure that the pasta comes inside without water? Yeah, very good. Nice. Yeah, now inside the pasta. Okay. Good, chef. So, you know, a lot of. A lot of people cooking the pasta, make the pasta on the plate and then the sauce on the top. So walk what you can do. Every time the pasta in the sauce. Now give the pasta one minute time, let the pasta absorb all the sauce, and then you have a beautiful pasta. But it smells good. You know, I like it a little bit. I like a little bit spicy. Oh, yes. I love it. Yeah, I'm the spicy man. Oh, very good. I like a little bit spicy. Okay. Be careful. This is very spicy. This is a dry chili. You told me your mama loves to visit. Okay. Very good. Where are you going? So now we are ready. Come back here, Theo. Lovely pasta. I tell you. Mama, I always enjoy. I tell you. Come on, my boys. 
Come on, you don't like your job anymore? Well, guys, come on here. Who wants a promotion? Who was the guy? You want to be promoted? You want promoted? Huh? Right, come here. Right. Don't be shy. Don't. You are the first one. Let's go. Say you come back. Come here. Right. Enjoy. Oh, delicious. I tell you. Is it good? It's good. Where's the other one? Why are you crying? <laughs> Theo, Theo, don't hide. I know where you are. Asia, Asia, you eat come spicy on. or not? That's my son. That come on, come on, come on. Me too. Come on, come on, son. For daddy, come on, for daddy. There we go. Now you see. Mmm. Say hi, daddy. <laughs> Enjoy. Well, he enjoy. You're chicken. Let me try it. Yes, of I course. Do. I'm sure it's everybody good. can try it. I tell you. Good. <laughs> <laughs> you know, as I'm a, I'm a professional cook, I'm for every very spicy, very spicy. Yeah. For all situation, I prepared. I have an emergency kit. If this happened for you, I have every time this one in the fridge. You know? And you enjoy the second and third time. <laughs> the chef, you know. <laughs>